That fee is targeted to the location, to locations, and the revenues from it stay in the community that are hosting the drilling. They can use it for local public services as a gap funding for transportation. They can upgrade or build water and sewer lines, and also the added cost to the court systems from all the deed work surrounding the wells can be recovered. They can even reduce their county or municipal taxes. The point is that the money reaches the people and the local communities without coming through Harrisburg. You know, when you look at these, the impact fees, uh, going back to some of these uh, small townships, townships that are in my district, townships with budgets of $100,000 to $150,000, they're going to receive maybe $50,000 in impact fees. That doesn't sound like much. People, people around the state might laugh about that, $50,000. But when you have a $150,000 budget, it makes a difference. It allows them to replace a piece of equipment they couldn't afford. It allows them to do some betterment for the community, maybe in park recreation, replace drainage that needs done, and fix some roads. It's a huge, huge game changer. I think one thing that we have learned over uh, the years is how to manage this balance of demand for energy against protecting and conserving uh, the environment. And with this bill, I think we've done that. And the fruits of that are reflected in what we're talking about today in terms of the return of dollars to our local municipalities.